Hey guys, welcome to yet another video and in this video I will be covering my favorite topic which is hidden android system features and tricks. These features and tricks will be valid for most of the phones running on android lollipop 5.0 or above till the latest version of the no good. So let's dig in deep and let's get right into it. We have a hell lot of games and especially FPS games available on Play Store and they are very graphic heavy these days. So if your phone is not able to run those games smoothly, you can enable an option named as Force 4X MSAA and here is how to do it. You just need to go to your phone setting option then go to the developers option and just scroll down and search for the desired Force 4X MSAA option and just enable it. But make sure to disable the option after you are done playing the games as this might be a bit hard on your battery. See, there are all types of application available there on the Google Play Store. Some can be trusted, some cannot be. And several of them ask for the device location. But Google gives you the option of not letting that app use your current location or the actual location. Hence, we have an options in the developers mode in which when you will toggle that on for the selected apps, that selected app will be getting the mocked or fake location so that your safety is not compromised as the group of developers of that particular app may use that in a negative way. Now, getting to the calling things then it is very annoying to hang up a call as we have to wait for a second or two for the screen to be back as it gets off due to the presence of the proximity sensor but now you can even do it with the power button. So when you are done talking to your friend or family members you just can hit the power button in order to hang up. In order to enable it you just need to go to the phone setting then accessibility then scroll down and you will see an option named as power button and scroll. Just toggle that on and you are way to go. On the platform named Android, when you leave an application, it is still there in the memory using the local cache data. So that when you open the application again, it will load faster. But in some cases, this might lead to lagging and even hanging off your device if it is backed by poor hardware. So in that case, you can restrict the activities. To do that, you have to go to the phone setting again. Then to the developers option and toggle on the option don't keep activities, which will erase all the cache memory as soon as you leave the application. As mentioned earlier that application after being closed on Android is still present in the local cache data and to stop that we did a process but if you move back from one application to another and multitask your experience will not be that great. So in order to have some processes, limited processes in the background you can do this. Just go to the phone setting again and then to the developer option. Set the limit of maximum background processes to 4 and that's it. Once you are done doing this, the maximum number of activities which will be running in the background will be 4. So that will not be hard on the hardware and thus will not result in the lagging or even the hanging of your device. If still it continues then go for the fourth mentioned hidden setting which is stop the activities. The SD card got corrupted for rest of the videos so part 2 will be coming tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. Do subscribe for that and stay tuned. When it is uploaded, I will add a card here and put a link right there in the description. It has some great features and easter eggs. Do subscribe guys.